welcome to Graphic Online News in Brief. In the headlines, police place 50,000 cities bounty on suspected robbers. GFA appoints Milovan Raivac as new Black Stars head coach. Ghana to receive 1.3 million Pfizer vaccines from the US. And Tupperware honors top performing Africa sales falls. News in Brief is brought to you by Graphic News Plus. Download your Graphic News Plus now and choose your preferred package daily, weekly, monthly, and annually. And access free news on various interest areas as well. Graphic News Plus, connecting people through news. And on the News in Brief, the Ghana Police Service has placed a 50,000 cities bounty on a robbery gang suspected to have been engaged in a daylight robbery at Sampa Valley near Weja in the Greater Accra region. The gang of four who were armed allegedly attacked and robbed a woman of an unspecified amount of money. A video on social media shows the suspected robbers on motorbikes and welding guns accosting the victim's vehicle and opening the back door of the vehicle before bolting away with a backpack containing an unspecified amount of money amid the firing of warning shots to ward off onlookers. The victim is said to have gone to the bank to withdraw money and was attacked a few minutes after she drove out of the bank. The police is urging the public and corporate institutions who intend to withdraw and deposit huge sums of money to exercise caution or contact them for assistance with such transactions. 67-year-old Serbian trainer Milovan Raivac has been named as a new head coach of the Black Stars. This is the second time the Serbian has been given the nod to lead the Black Stars of Ghana, having initially been appointed in 2008. A three-member committee tasked with finding the country a new manager following the dismissal of Charles Kwabla Akono on September 14 settled on Rajivak. He has been handed a one-year deal with an option for further year if he qualifies the Black Stars to the World Cup. He will earn $30,000 every month. Rajivak will be assisted by Dortmund assistant coach Otuado and Maxwell Kunedu. His first task is to defeat Zimbabwe in a double header in the World Cup qualifiers and subsequently qualify the team to the World Cup in 2022. Uh, I remember the first time I came here 13 years ago, I promised that I would do anything in my power to, that I would use my experience and knowledge to take Ghana to the World Cup. And I was the happiest man after we succeeded. And I hope that we can achieve great things again. Ghana will soon receive some 1.3 million Pfizer vaccines from the United States government. The donation adds up to some 1.2 million Moderna vaccines donated by the U.S. on 4th September 2021. The U.S. Vice President Kamala Harris made this known on Thursday when she held bilateral talks with President Ekufuadu at the White House. The talks centered on strengthening the ties of cooperation and friendship that existed between the two countries. Addressing a press conference prior to the holding of a closed-door meeting between the pair and their delegations, U.S. Vice President Harris said both countries share the same commitment to minimize the effects of COVID-19. In a final story, a Ghanaian teacher, Mrs. Barbara Badamosi, has been awarded the overall top team leader at the 2020-2021 African Jubilee of Tupperware Brands. Mrs. Badamosi received a brand new Toyota Rush. Speaking to Graphic Online, she thanked the company for the honor and also commended the company for their achievements. <laughs> If you want to join, we are telling you, you don't need to be a full-time Tupperware consultant. You can do it on the side and you will still earn the reward. The, the company has given me a car, but within those few years that I joined Tupperware, that Tupperware came to Ghana, I can boast of a three-bedroom house I bought personally from the proceeds of Tupperware. So there's a lot more to come. Thank you for
for watching. We'll see you again with another edition. Stay safe and protect yourself from COVID-19. For more news, visit graphic.com.gh or log on to Facebook at Daily Graphic and on YouTube at GraphicGH. I am Juliet Echa Safo. Subscribe now.